Hi everybody, this is the Math 10C Trigonometry Review. This is multiple choice number one. The question here says determine the tangent of A and the tangent of C in this diagram. Okay, so let's zoom in a little bit here so we can see it. Okay, so tangent of A, in order to answer this question you have to remember what the definitions are. And the tangent of A is going to be equal to the ratio of the side opposite a over the side adjacent to A. Okay? So here's angle A. The side opposite it is the side that, that A is not made up of. So it's going to be 8. And the side adjacent to A is going to be one of the sides that helps create the angle A. Now, it can't be the longest one here. That's the hypotenuse. So it's got to be this one right here. So it's going to be 10. So the tangent of A is going to be 8 over 10. Now notice this question is not asking us to find the angle, just the tangent of A. So for example, when I look at, at uh, A here, it can't be A because that's give, trying to give me the, uh, what the angles are. And the tangent of A cannot be equal to a degree. It's got to be equal to a ratio. But I can see from here that it could be, could be B, 10 is equal to 0.8. Uh, could be C, where it says 10 is equal to 0.8. But it can't be D because again, we're, we're throwing angles in there. So now let's go back and take a look at tan C. Okay, tan C is going to be, here's the angle, is going to be equal to the ratio of the side opposite, sorry, I should throw that to make that more equals. It's going to be equal to the ratio of the side length opposite the C, okay? So that, again, that's the side that's not being used to make up the angle, so it's going to be 10 over, and then the adjacent side to it is going to be 8. Okay, again, the adjacent side is one of the sides that helps make the angle and we're not including the hypotenuse. And so, okay, 10 over 8, uh, just to make, convert that to a decimal here, divide 10 divided by 8 is going to be 1.25. So, turns out here, uh, it's the answer we can see right now on the screen, it's got to be C.